Hey guys, Thor here and welcome back to another Candy Chaos unboxing. I know I haven't done um, one of these in a while but you know, um, personal life has kind of got in the way so it's been unfortunate but you know, I've been trying to like take photos and still upload them mainly on my Instagram. So yeah, but um, I literally just got my box about 10 minutes ago and it's quite a bit bigger than usual. Usually like the box is about that thick I think. I don't know. It just seems bigger than usual. But anyway, I'm really looking forward to this month's box because I believe it is Halloween like zombie themed, which is really cool because Halloween is my favorite holiday of the year, literally. I just, mm, I don't know why. It's always been my favorite holiday and it's not about like going out and trick or treating. I guess I've always been kind of into like the weird stuff. Well, not really weird, but like witches and vampires and all that kind of stuff, so. I don't know, it's kind of like my holiday, I guess. Um, but I've always loved Halloween, so yeah, I'm really looking forward to this. So, let's open it up. And first thing we have is the like usual postcards. We've got Creepy Chaos, which is cool because, you know, if you like creepy stuff, then that's there. I personally can't stand creepy things because they freak me out. Um, I do watch The Walking Dead, which I absolutely love. And um, like The Nightmare Before Christmas, I watch it every single Halloween and Christmas because it can it can work with both <laughs> but other than that i don't really do creepy things or else i think i'd probably quite like this box so yeah i'll leave links to all these companies like in the description like to all their websites then there's the comic chaos one we've got that as usual and then obviously the candy chaos one so yeah i'll leave them all as i said in the description okay we've got all the brown paper as usual yay brown paper okay so the first thing is some zombie jerky all right so it says on the back, like it's got a little thing that says, if you're reading this, the zombie apocalypse has happened and it's awesome. <laughs> so yeah, and it just says like um, a little bit, bit about it. This looks really weird. It kind of reminds me of um, the dragon jerky, I think. Someone got out of um, Loot Crate. Yeah, someone gave me some, um, their dragon jerky. I think it's dragon jerky. Yeah, and it kind of looks the same. It's got the same like weird green powder on it, which is really weird. But yeah. I don't know if I'll be trying that because I'm not a fan of regular jerky, but you know, we'll see. Next we have a moon pie. Ooh, that looks quite cool. I don't know if this, is this by the same company as the Twinkies? I don't know. I have a feeling it might be, but it's probably not because I'm, I'm not good with that kind of stuff. Um, yeah, but it looks cool. I don't know. The next thing I see, ironically, is a Twinkie. Personally, I can't stand Twinkies. I don't think they taste very nice, but um, I don't like cake in general, so I suppose that kind of doesn't really help. But um, this will just be like, I'll pass it along to someone. Maybe my goddaughter, I'm going out trick-or-treating with her um, this Halloween. So maybe I'll give it to her. She might like it, I guess, <laughs> something like that. Um, the next thing is a giant rainbow nerds rope. Now, I love these. <laughs> I really do. I love the nerds. I think they're possibly one of my favourite things. Oh, this is just so good. And then my only problem with the nerds rope is when you eat it, they all fall off. Like all the little nerds fall off. So you'll end up with, I don't know, nerds everywhere. <laughs> but yeah. Ooh. This is quite cool. We've got some little brain bites. I like little pink, I'm guessing sugar cube type things. Ooh, they're watermelon. Yeah, yeah, I like watermelon. It says energy candy. It's got caffeine in it, so that might be good for Halloween night. Um, I'm going trick or treating, as I said, with my goddaughter and about five or six of her friends. So, yeah, that's about five or six five year olds that I'm going with. So, yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of energy. Ooh, the next thing I see is cricket. Now, you may um, have seen Ash Dubs like challenging recently and he ate crickets and yeah that was not very um, entertaining to watch so i don't know whether i'll be eating these maybe i will get my brother to eat these because i bet he will and they're bacon and cheese flavored so you know mm, i don't really fancy eating ch uh, crickets myself i don't know about you but yeah <laughs> okay and the next thing is oh there we go Ooh, zombie energy drink awaken the dead that's cool got like a zombie energy drink as i said i think this is all kind of 
it's a bit zombie themed but not like completely because yeah not all of it's obviously halloweeny oh there's another twinkie there um yeah but yeah i quite like that and i like energy drinks so we got another one the mustache elixir that was really nice so yeah that one was actually blue and it turned my bro uh, my tongue bright blue for i think at least a day that was quite weird but yeah um next thing is pocky now i absolutely love pocky it is probably my favorite like japanesey thing um i love pretzels and i love chocolate and these are kind of like pretzel sticks with chocolate on so you can't go wrong really i mean it's, you can't go wrong so yeah i love them and then we have some popcorn i think this is it is act two yes butter lovers popcorn so yeah i think that's just popcorn i don't know where it's from um probably america though i don't really know it has um like spanish on the back i'm pretty sure that's spanish so maybe not america maybe like mexico or something but yeah that's quite cool i love popcorn i swear i have a popcorn addiction it is just it's quite sad really <laughs> yeah then we have oh a jolly rancher now i've wanted to try these for ages like the proper jolly ranchers we had some last month which were um candy apple flavored and oh my god they were so delicious but these ones are just the normal ones and it's an apple flavored one and yay look forward to that and we have some toxic waste goop gum now i have a feeling that this is going to be extremely sour and it's quite like it's solid on the outside i'm guessing and then it's gonna have like gooey stuff on the inside but yeah oozing with sour slime <laughs> so i'm gonna be saving like most of this stuff for around halloween because you know it's halloween box so you have to eat at halloween i mean come on and then we've got like a hershey's like a mini 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 thing that's really tiny but yeah that's quite cool i'm glad that it's not a full heart hershey's bar because i quite frankly think that hershey's tastes like the really cheap chocolate we get in the uk possibly even worse than the really cheap chocolate we get in the uk so i'm sorry americans but it just doesn't taste nice next we have some popping candy and it's cherry flavored which is good because i absolutely love cherry so yeah and we have some laffy taffy strawberry flavored i love laffy taffy we've had a couple of them and we have a couple more like so yeah we have a couple more of them We've had a few different um, Laffy Taffy things, but I haven't had a strawberry one yet, so I'm looking forward to that. And um, we actually have a few more of these Tango things. A few different flavours. We've got some orange ones, an apple one, so yeah. Oh, and another apple one, another orange one. Um, yeah, that's quite a few, which is good. And we've got two more goopy gum things, those sour things. Another Jolly Rancher. We've got some crackle. Oh, it's like chocolate with Rice Krispies in. That's quite cool. So we've got um two of them. It's Hershey's chocolate again, but it has Rice Krispies in, so it might taste a bit nicer. I don't know. Um, we have a skeleton that is unfortunately open, but oh well. Um, it's candy powder in a plastic skeleton. What? Oh, like the head comes off, I think, and there's powder inside. That's quite cool. Um, it was just open at the bottom, but I mean, it's in a plastic thing, so that's okay. And like, that's not the company's fault. That's just like a the manufacturer's fault. So yeah, there we go. It's a good job it's in a plastic thing and it isn't just powder because that would be annoying. <laughs> um, next we have some nerds. Yay! I just said how much I love nerds, so yay. Tiny packet of them. That's really cute. Then we have some starbursts. Oh, it's candy corn, but it's not like proper candy corn. It's like got um, strawberry, orange, lemon, and cherry. And it's just like candy corn shaped, I guess. I'm kind of disappointed there isn't any actual candy corn in here because I think that's, whenever I think of Halloween, I think of candy corn, even though we don't get it in the UK. Um, it's an American thing, but maybe they couldn't get it. I don't really know. But it would be nice to see some actual candy corn, I guess. And then we have some Reese's pumpkin peanut butter cups which is saving the best till last, I think, because I love peanut butter, I love pumpkins, and I love the just Reese's peanut butter cups, they're so nice. So yeah, that's what we got this month. That is like a huge amount of stuff. It's a lot of smaller stuff, again, which I like. Um, last month we got a huge box of 10 Twinkies, and as I already said, I don't really like Twinkies, so I ended up giving them all away, which is fine, 
but um, I prefer it when there's smaller stuff and you get like lots of it because obviously it's, um, I don't know, there's more chance of you liking a lot of the stuff. But yeah, um, I think it's worth checking out next month's box because it is going to be a box um, selected by Snake Doctor. You all probably know him and he is selecting all the sweets, like all his favourite sweets and they're going into the box. So yeah, I think that'll be quite a cool box. I know I'm definitely looking forward to it. I can definitely guess a couple of the things that are going to be in there. Um, I think there's about like five or six things that I, I know are definitely going to be in there. So yeah, I think that's going to be really cool though. So um, thank you guys for watching again. Um, yeah, make sure to subscribe and leave a like. And uh, yeah, I'll try and do more of these unboxings because I do like unboxing them. Um, obviously, as I said, like personal life and stuff's got in the way. I've been ill a couple of times, so I haven't really been able to record them. But yeah, I'll try and do some more if you guys like them. And yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!